President Uhuru Kenyatta has underscored the role of the youth in the social development of the nation through their selfless acts. Well, the head of state who hosted 907 gold awardees of the President's Awards program at State House Nairobi commended the group for their resilience and being uh, solution-oriented in the face of crisis. For the first time, the program attracted 32 prison officers and inmates. Friday at State House Nairobi. The 2022 President's Award Ceremony is underway with 907 gold awardees receiving their certificates from President Uhuru Kenyatta. The awardees, part of the program that seeks to instill life skills and virtues to young people and equip them to make a difference in the society. Nyeri Women Prisons. The awards this year also incorporating 32 prison officers and inmates. President Uhuru Kenyatta hailing the young people for their selfless acts and devotion to service delivery. Our young people are learning to find opportunities within crisis, to extend empathy and understanding, to care for and to protect the vulnerable, and to learn what servant leaders do within their communities. It has been an enlightening experience. I feel so proud of this erstwhile scheme that helps young Kenyans to understand and appreciate the ideals of hard work, determination, consciousness, teamwork, respect, discipline, selflessness, and breaking the walls of negative ethnicity and all other vices. To further boost the operations of the program, the head of state has increased the budgetary allocation from the current 5 million shillings to 50 million shillings annually. The of our time, therefore, is to prepare the next generation of Kenyans with the skills, the attitude, the civic virtues, and the character required for their success as workers, entrepreneurs, family members, and citizens of our country. It's only what you work for that is yours, and President's Award instilled this in our children. So let this not be just a ceremony, but a nucleus towards a bigger thing which will lead to our people to think backwards. Young people are social actors of change and progress. They form a crucial segment of a nation's development and hence their contribution is highly needed. Our young people, therefore, should not only be treated as the leaders of tomorrow, but also as partners of today. One of the awardees, Mary Wanjiko, an inmate at Langata Women's Prison, caught the ear of the president as she pleaded for her freedom. Wanjiku was convicted in 2013 for robbery with violence and was sentenced to 25 years in prison. Everybody deserves a second chance. The President's Award is a self-development program to all young people that aims at equipping them with positive life skills to make a difference for themselves, their communities, country and the world. It was founded by Prince Philip in 1956 and launched in Kenya by former President Mze Jomo Kenyatta in 1966. <laughs> Nancy Okwari, Easy Friday.